Hi there, welcome to my channel. My name is Monica and I'm an independent sales representative with Avon. And today I thought we'd chat about the 2023 best selling products at Avon. I was on the Avon site and I just kind of stumbled across this blog post about the best selling products. And I thought it'd be really fun to chat about because some of the products I have, so I know this, they are really good, but some of the products I haven't even tried. So I thought it was pretty interesting that they were best sellers. As an Avon representative for one year, I'm pretty surprised that I haven't discovered these products myself. Um, but anyways, let's, uh, let's put on some glasses and get to chatting. You'll notice that I have moved my clothing out of the way because <laughs> I am hoping to post some pictures right there, but we'll see how that goes. And you know, the editing Monica is not very good, but I will try. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. All right. So the first product that was a top seller um, at Avon is the FMG Glimmer Waterproof Eyeliners. I have one in chocolate brown. These are good. They're long wearing. Um, they go on, they don't go on as smooth as another aligner that I'm going to mention, but they are good. I don't know if they're waterproof per se. Like I said, they're long wearing, but I haven't dunked myself in the pool to see if this runs. I, you know, but it is long wearing and I do use it and it's really good. So I agree that is a, that is a good product and I'm, I'm not surprised it is in the top 10. The next product is the FMG Glimmer Cream Eyeliner, which is this one right here. This one is in black as black and it is really creamy and it is long wearing. And what I like about, about it is that the creaminess is really good if you have textured eyelids. So my eyelids are a little texture, textured. I'm heading toward my sixties. You know, the skin isn't smooth and amazing anymore, but it's good enough. <laughs> but this just glides right over any bumps or lumps in your eyes. It's very smooth, very creamy. You can take a brush and sort of smooth it out even further. These are great. I can, I can see why they're a top 10 product. Next up is the uh, Moisture Therapy Intense Healing and Repair Cream. That is this product right here, which I actually use every night. I'll do a little routine where I'll do some scrub on my hands and then I'll put a little retinol or whatever, whatever I've used on my face, I'll put on the back of my hands and then I will coat my hands in this. And yeah, I wake up with really smooth, soft hands. This is a really great product. Uh, it has a Hydro Boost technology. I don't quite know what that means, but I would say this is very comparable to the um, Neutrogena Nor Norwegian formula. That's why I would say that this is similar to, but also a good product. All right, next up is the FMG Glimmer Brow Definer, which I also have. And this is also a very good product. I have mine in just brown, brunette. This product right here, I'm actually wearing it today. It had, what was interesting to me and I didn't know is that it is infused with um, castor oil and castor oil can be helpful uh, for the hair follicle health. So pretty cool, I like that. The only problem I have with this is that it doesn't look like a brow pencil. So one day I was putting on my makeup and I, I grabbed this by mistake and I was trying to line underneath my eyes with this. And it was, I was wondering like, what's going on? It's so waxy, what is this stupid pencil? And then I finally looked, I'm like, oh, <laughs> this is for my eyebrows. This is not gonna work as an eyeliner. It does not work as an eyeliner, totally. But I do wish that it was, more in an eyeliner form. So I wish that it was more like, this is the FMG Kathy Cat uh, brow pencil because it has the spoolie on the end. And so I wish the brow definer was more brow like product. And then I wouldn't mix it up with eyeliner. So, you know, other than that, it is a good brow product. And I, I, I think it's a top 10 product. All right, next up, kind of surprised me and I don't have the product. So hopefully I can put the picture here uh, to the products. This is, I'm just going to do five and six together because it's a, a men's product is the Wild Country Roll-On Antiperson Deodorant. And number six is the Black Suede Roll-On Antiperson Deodorant. So either we have some really great hygienic men shopping at Avon or the ladies are purchasing it for their husbands and guys and boyfriends. And, um, I kind of think it's the latter, <laughs> but that's, that's pretty cool. I've, I've not tried, obviously I've not tried that product. My husband is a stick guy, so he wouldn't be interested in a roll on, but apparently it is a, a top 10 selling product at Avon. 
Um, and that goes into the next product, which is the Feeling Fresh Roll-On Antiperspirant Deodorant. I also have not tried this product. I'm also a stick person, um, but they say that this is a non-stick formula. I'm kind of curious, so I think I'll probably add it to my cart uh, next campaign. All right, and let's see, what is number eight? That was number seven. Uh, this is number eight. This is the FMG Glimmer Satin Lipsticks. Totally, totally a bestseller. I love a lot of the colors, but my favorite is Plum Blossom. That's this product right here. This is Plum Blossom. Really pretty. Definitely that plummy color. I'm not wearing that today, of course. I kind of should have thought of that. I'm actually wearing um, the Butter Gloss, which is what I really like. I'm not surprised that this didn't make the top 10. This is kind of a new product, so this is a good product and one of my favorites, but the Glimmer Lipsticks are really great. They're priced really well. They're a, they're like $2 less than a Revlon or a L'Oreal lipstick, but and they are pretty nice. So definitely a top 10 product. All right, that was number eight. We're on number nine, which is the FMG Glimmer Diamond Eyeliners. These are also good and I have these as well. I have two. One is not really a favorite of mine, but um, it, it's okay. I'm actually wearing it. Um, this is the Diamond Eyeliner in Brown Sugar. It doesn't really go on all that well. So it's not really a favorite of mine. You can get it to work, but the Brown Sugar is not my favorite. The one that's really beautiful, oh my goodness, is the uh, Smoky Diamond. This one is so beautiful. It has like, I, I, I wanna, I'll swatch it for you. You probably won't be able to see. It has like little teeny, teeny blue sparkles in it in the gray. You can definitely, if you shine a light on it, you can definitely, yeah, I can't see it. That's a shame. It is really, really beautiful. Definitely worth, worth picking up. This is the Smoky Diamond. Definitely worth picking up. All right, and last is the Skin So Soft Original Bath Oil. Not really surprised. Skin So Soft is a flagship product of Avon. Um, I personally don't have the original. I have the Soft and Sensual. So this is the product that would is the number one seller, which I find really funny because I, I really like the gel oil. I think the gel oil is fabulous. I think it's so much easier to use. It's in this lovely gel, kind of a clear gel. I don't know if you can see it, if I can, it's a little gel. And it's, it's so easy, just rubbing in. No mess, smells great. I thought this was funny. They described the Skin So Soft bath oil as fresh herbal scent. I don't get that. I, I think it smells like a, just, just a yummy powdery scent. Yeah, I don't think it smells herbal to me, but the gel oil is an underrated product. I'm kind of surprised it didn't make the top 10, but the Skin So Soft in general was the, was the top 10. So that was the top 10, and I thought I'd mention two, you know, products that I kind of wish made the list, but they didn't quite make the list. And one of the products is, of course, uh, mascaras. I think Avon has the best mascaras. And this particular one is the FMG Glimmer. This is the Extend one, Super Extend. This is a great mascara. Um, so is the washable waterproof mascara. I don't have that one handy. But uh, this is the one with the funny little ball on the end, which is really great for getting those little little tiny lashes in the corner. So it has that little ball at the tip. So I think this is a great mascara. I'm surprised none of the mascaras made the list. Very sad. <laughs> honorable mention though. And the second honorable mention is the um, FMG Kathy Cat uh, Shadow Sticks, the uh, matte shadow sticks. This particular one is in Azure. I have to put the sticky on it because I can't see, like, I can't see that. <laughs> There's no way I can do that. And what I like doing with these is I put them on the outer corner. You probably can't see, but I have this color, this beautiful blue on the outer corner of my eye. And it's just, it's gorgeous. And these don't budge. These are really solid. So I really do like these. So I'm surprised it didn't make the list. So if you see any products that you are interested in or would like to try, those are, you know, the top 10 and I will put a list below. If, you know, you're interested, let me know or, you know, just cruise the website and see what you can find. There's lots of great products on Avon.com. And if you have any chit chat questions, let me know them down in the comment below and I'll talk to you later.